Hi, I'm Dolly from Herrera Elementary. Here at Herrera Elementary, we learn lots of exciting and new things. STEAM, the abbreviation for Science, Technology, Engineering, and Arts and Mathematics. STEAM includes coding, like we did, 3D design and printing, and robotics. This is Mr. Han, the person who leads robotics, 3D printing, and coding. We are working on designing a space shuttle. Here's a project. And this is the finished product. We also have a robotics club. And as you can see, all the robotics kits are over there. Here at Herrera, fit through kindergarten, learn coding. <clears throat> yes, you heard me. Kindergarten does coding. And that is the exciting things we learned here at Aurora. We designed 3D objects by using the app Tinkercad. Now I'm going to show you how to print the space shuttle in our amazing 3D printer. What we do is that we go on Tinkercad, copy it onto the USB, then we put it inside. Before you even think about touching print, always make sure you put on the glue, or else there's no point in printing it, it's just going to go flying. So we apply the glue. Then we click print. First, we turn on the 3D printer by pressing the circle button. It'll say touch screen to start. Touch it. Click print. <clears throat> then I look through what, what I'm looking until we get there's a rocket. We tap it and it'll start printing. Right now it is loading it. Oh, you hear that? It's getting hot. So when it goes through here, it melts and creates the shuttle. Which the finished project product looks like this. You don't want to touch that because that's where it's melting it and that's how you burn your finger. It'll take about 2 hours and 35 minutes. Look, it's starting to break. So it gets very close. All inside is where the magic happens. It's melting so it can be reproduced. Right now it's heating it up. Earlier it was just loading the file. And that is how you print. All this we created using the 3D printer. This scanner to scan and print actual people. My friend over here was scanned and printed. This is coding. It says get flower, so if she gets on the flower, then it's going to collect the flower. Fifth grade, we do the Mindstorms EV3. Here's a kit. It's an EV3 robot that me and my friend Javier created. Let me turn it on so you can see how it goes. As you can see, right now it is on. Next one. Put it in the floor. And that is a program that me and my friend Javier created. Thank you.